microbes are very tiny. Most microorganisms are invisible unless we magnify them with a microscope, and that's the reason that we were unaware of their existence until the 17th century. Two, Earth is a microbial planet. The fact that microorganisms are so small has allowed us to ignore the fact that they're everywhere and that they run the biosphere, that most biology is microbiology. Three, microbes have been here a lot longer than us. Life is 3.6 billion years old and was wholly microbial for the first 2.6 billion years of that immense history. Number four, microbes are very diverse. If we look at microbial genetics, we see far greater diversity than we encounter among the, 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 the banality, relative banality of the animals and plants. Five, microorganisms show greater metabolic virtuosity than animals and plants. Solar-powered microbes use sunlight like green plants and then other bacteria, green and purple species, perform photosynthesis using different mechanisms. Mineral-powered microorganisms live in the dark and power themselves with sulfur, iron and hydrogen gas. Some species dispense with oxygen and breathe nitrate, sulfate and metals. Six, microbes are resistant to the conditions, the environmental circumstances that kill us. They can live in boiling hydrothermal springs, they can grow in freezing Antarctic lakes, they can grow and divide in water that's as, as acidic as battery acid, and they can survive punishing doses of ionizing radiation. And the resilience of microorganisms makes it seem quite reasonable that they might, or something like microbial biology may exist on Goldilocks planets. Seven, viruses are not cells. They're much simpler in organization than a cell, and viruses actually assemble their, their particles within the cells that they infect, including, of course, human cells. Eight, disease is often an immunological phenomenon. We think of infectious disease often resulting from chance encounters with pathogenic microorganisms, but in many cases, it's the failure of our immune system that sets us up for colonization by microorganisms. Nine, antibiotics are miracle drugs. Even with the specter of antibiotic resistant bacteria today, it's important to recognize and that uh, the, the discovery and development of antibiotics was one of the triumphs of Western science and medicine. 10, we're mobile ecosystems. We're filled with bacteria, we're covered with bacteria and other microorganisms, and we, we live on a microbial planet. Most biology is microbiology.